Welcome students to the new chapter more on MS Word 2007. First, let us see how to insert word art in MS Word. Word art is designed to make your text more attractive. You can format your text to make it look like a picture and enhance its appearance in different ways. The steps to insert word art are as follows. Place the cursor where you want to insert word art. Select the insert tab. In the text group, click the word art button. Word art menu appears. Select the desired word art style. Type the text in the text area and click OK. Now you can move and resize it just like a picture. Also, you can change the word art style from the word art styles group. You can select any style and click on it. How to change page margins in MS Word? The margin is the space between the text and border of a document. By default, it is a 1 inch space. Depending on your needs, it can be changed by the following steps. Select the Page Layout tab. In the Page Setup group, click the Margins command. A list of margins appear. Select the desired margin with a left click. To customize margins, click on the expansion arrow in the Page Setup. The Page Setup window opens. Enter the desired margin size and click OK. Now let us see how to insert header and footer in MS Word. Header and footer allow you to add additional informations like dates, file names, page numbers at the top or bottom of your document. The basic steps to set up a header and footer are as follows. Select the insert tab. Locate the header and footer group. It shows header and footer commands. As required, click either header or footer command. It displays a list of built-in header or footer option. Select the desired option. Enter the text for the header. Now you can close the header. You can follow the same steps to set up the footer also. Select the desired option and close the footer. You can split your text to columns as shown in the image. It helps you make your text more readable and presentable. The steps involved in this process are as follows. Open the document. Select the Page Layout tab. In Page Setup group, click the Columns command. It displays a list of options to split text into columns. Select the desired option. You can also adjust the width of the columns according to your requirement. Dear students, in this module, we have discussed about how to add word art, page margins, headers and footers and to split text to columns.